everyone. In this lesson, we're going to look at the steps to reset the Microsoft Edge browser to its default settings on Windows 11 and on Windows 10. If the browser is having problems or an extension or an app modifies the settings without permissions, you can reset the settings to their default factory defaults. Okay, let's add on to steps to reset the Microsoft Edge settings. But before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. There are two methods that you can use to reset the Edge settings. The official method, the browser will reset the startup page, the new tab page, search engine, and pin apps. In addition, it will disable extension and clear the browsing data. However, the browser settings, bookmarks, passwords, and profile will not be deleted. So to reset Microsoft Edge, do this. Open Start and look for Microsoft Edge and open the app. Now open the settings. Go to Reset Settings, click the Restore Settings to their default values. And here you get a brief description of what's going to happen. And you can just click the Reset button. After a few moments, the browser will complete resetting the settings to the second method. It's a workaround that deletes everything from the browser. When you use this option, you will have to reconfigure Microsoft Edge all over again. So this will delete everything that is stored on the computer, including password, bookmarks, browsing history, startup page, and all the settings in the browser. So if you want to completely reset the browser, this is what you do. Open Start and look for File Explorer. Now we're going to go to this PC and open the C drive, then go to the users folder. Now open the folder for your account. And now we need to open the view menu and make sure to select the hidden items. Then we're going to open the hidden app data folder. From here, we're going to go to local and then we're going to look for the Microsoft folder and we're going to go inside of it. And in here, we need to delete the edge folder. But before we do that, right click on the taskbar and open the task manager. And make sure that in the process tab, type Microsoft Edge and make sure to close any running processes by selecting the process group and clicking the end button. This will make sure that nothing about Microsoft Edge is running on the computer at this particular time. Otherwise, you won't be able to delete the Edge folder. Now, right click on the folder and select the delete option. Now, you can close this location and when you open Microsoft Edge, you will not have to start from scratch as if this is the first time that you're opening the web browser. However, if you're signing in with the Microsoft account, that account will be used to create the first profile. So if we go to the settings and we go to profiles, you can see there were sign in with the account associated with the Windows 11 account. Now, since all the settings has been removed from this installation, you're going to have to go and reconfigure all the settings for Microsoft Edge. Those are two ways to reset the Microsoft Edge settings on Windows 11. And this instruction will also work on Windows 10. To like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I, and I would like to thank you for viewing.